Hey Aries, welcome to your messages, a different layout for you this time guys. We're going to see what's going on in your present situation. The tower, so currently you've got the tower, something shocking, surprising, um, not always having to be negative, but it's something you're not expecting, something that's going to change uh, your life here. Um, maybe even feel like it's throwing you off course, but it's an actual redirection. Um, so this is what we're, what we're starting with. Aries, if you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month. To my lovely, loyal subscribers, welcome back, guys. So let's see what is crossing your current situation. Uh, it could even be what's causing the tower. Take it how it resonates. It is a general reading, guys. Okay, so what's crossing you? Mm, Prince of Cups. So that's the Knight of Cups in the normal deck there. Um, a love offer. Could be quite surprising that this person uh, comes towards you here. There's a love offer coming at you at this time. You're not expecting it. Uh, it could be coming with an apology this night. He's kind of got his head down. Um, so might be just shocking to you that this person um, is interested or is making you this love offer. This person is basically coming towards you and saying, hey, I'm ready to love you. I'm in love with you and things like that. Um, mm, I feel like it is with the tower there with it. It's something you are not expecting at all. It's completely shocking to you that this person now makes you this love offer. Let's see what the foundation of this is. Um, Four of Cups. It's something you've waited for for a long time. Uh, you didn't see it coming. <laughs> wasn't expected. This is why it's a tower. This is why you're in a situation of a tower because you wasn't expecting that this person would now come and make you this romantic offer here. Um, they could be doing it without, with, because they're bored, they've got nothing left now. It could be if you know this person and they went off with a third party and they come back and make you this offer. Um, one of the reasons here could be that they was bored or they was unhappy, discontented with how that relationship played out. So you didn't see this person making you an offer because they might have already even been in a relationship or they showed no interest in you, uh, you know, that sort of thing. This is why it's completely shocking to you. Let's see the immediate past, uh, what was happening there and this person. Um, maybe with just you or just this person, we'll see how the message reads here. Nine of Pentacles. So in the immediate past, you're single here. You're open. Uh, I think you've rebuilt yourself as well with that Nine of Pentacles. It shows in the immediate past there's been some growth here. Let's check the immediate future, um, what's happening there. But with that Nine of Pentacles, it shows that, um, you know, you've grown, but you're open to a companion or you've been wanting a companion here or somebody or something is with you here. You're carrying something with you. We can see with this Nine of Pentacles, that bird there. So I see that, you know, you're open to this, but it might just be shocking uh, that, you know, you're getting this romantic offer now. Let's see the immediate future because this will let us know whether you want to accept, right? Um, it could be, if you're cross-watching for an Aries, it could be an Aries that now makes this romantic approach to you and that this is why you're shocked. Yep, in immediate future, they take action here with the King of Wands. So showing a lot of passion and attraction towards you. Um, it might just seem out of the blue or, you know, not in their personality. If they, if you've known each other, say at work for a long time and then all of a sudden they're like, Hey, do you want to grab dinner? And you're like, this person likes me. I, th I feel like it's just sh so shocking and not expected from this person. But in the very near future here, we see them pursuing you with the King of Wands energy. So this is somebody attracted to you. Um, let's see the distant future where this is going here. Ooh, wonderful. This is something that's turning into something good. Uh, they're really sure about that they want this they want to build this into love so if this is somebody new that you're meeting and it just seems like passion and fun and 
uh, playful with that King of Wands energy straight away. This is something that's going to turn into a love here with the Ace of Cups. So let's see your higher self, the message your higher self wants to give or their higher self in this situation here. So the Crown Chakra, Ten of Pentacles. Uh, something is going to be built here into a very strong relationship. Um, I would say... If you was watching this for like finances only, you could be starting a business that's going to lead to something huge here. But it feels more like a love interest, um, building a family, a connection with them, something, a home with them, something worthwhile, something that lasts with the Ten of Pentacles. Um, okay, let's get an outcome. Let's get an outcome because this is they have in their mind and you have in your mind, you wanting to build connections that are solid that last, that are worthwhile. Um, so I don't feel like you want to waste time because you built all the way up to nine of pentacles here. So the next step is to build this everlasting love, you know. Um, so this is quite shocking that it's come to you now. Let's see. Um, yeah, I feel like somebody has been watching you, um, learning from you. Uh, this is you learning here, a lot of spiritual growth, finding a lot of answers in spirituality and things like that with the Hermit and the Princess of Swords there. So I do see you've grown a lot and we said that in the Nine of Pentacles anyway. Um, so this is somebody spying on you while you was doing a lot of soul searching, um, wanting to find out more about you. Um, I definitely feel like if this is a new person, we see the Princess of Swords as uh, the outcome of their offer is to get to know you, who you are, and to be able to move this forward. Um, so they could have been watching you for a long time if you've been while you've been going through this growth in the immediate past. We see that yeah, this person was taking notes, trying to figure out what you like and things like that before making this offer. Um, they were spying on you um but i feel this is somebody that is definitely has a soul tie with you and it's going to lead to more than just a fun time this is leading to love this is leading to a very stable worthwhile long-term relationship guys good luck <laughs>